Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Firearms of America. And today I have another tactical pen review for you guys. This is again 511 Tactical. They do have some pretty good stuff. I've reviewed some pants from them, some boots. Uh, and this is actually Ridgeline covered pants or covered, covered, covered pants, probably covered. <laughs> anyway, the style that you will find this in is actually 74411. They range somewhere between $35 and $75 currently on Amazon. The link is in the description below. There are about six different color variations. This is called Storm. In the camera, it kind of looks like it has two different shades, but no, it actually is nice gray color. I am really happy with the color actually. Uh, pretty good with the sizing. If you don't have time to watch the whole review, definitely good sizing. Uh, I would say average whenever it comes to comfort, a little bit less than average whenever it comes to mobility. Although because they are such a relaxed fit, they are not very tight at all. Uh, you do get that extra mobility, but we're gonna talk about all of this later in the review. Let's start it. So this is, as I've said, it's, it's the ultimate survival pants section, right, of, 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 of my channel. And here we discuss all the different gear, different clothing for the tactical situations, for the survival situations. Imagine if you had to run out of house quick and it was some sort of, you know, something scary happened and you need to run, you need to walk, climb, fight, do whatever to survive right would that be a good last pair of pants to put on pretty 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 straightforward review uh just just you know a few several different criteria that we're going to talk about that are important in survival situations and number one being the comfort obviously if these are the pants that you would put on and wear them for the next i don't know for the next 10 days for the next 20 days for the next three months would that be a good pair of pants i would say on the comfort level they are pretty comfortable they are very light the fabric is very light in fact the fabric is actually 62 percent polyester and 38 percent cotton uh, it is very durable it's very durable it's you know it's, if you if you if you bump into a piece of wood or something like that you're not going to get the splinter because they have that very very tough scratch and type of penetration little things fabric right uh, but here's the thing with that sort of protection with all of that resistance uh, comes obviously something that we sacrifice and we sacrifice flexibility uh, this 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 is the this is our criteria number two and it's the flexibility of the material I think personally to me flexibility is very important because it is kind of the basis of the mobility. You know, if your pants are not flexible, it will be hard to, uh, you know, fight, kicking with you with your legs. You know, doing things like climbing and jumping, jumping around. I don't know, doing the flips. I, I don't know. Whatever, whatever you have to do in your survival situation, right? But whatever has to do with mobility, it becomes harder to do with lack of flexibility of the material and unfortunately with this pant there is really no flexibility at all because they are a relaxed fit it is it, it, they, it, you do get mobility but at the same time with that relaxed fit obviously they are you know they're not tight fitting so they're pretty wide and it is much easier if you're climbing for example on the tree it's much easier to catch onto a random branches that you were not planning to catch on to, right? <laughs> okay, so number three, let's talk about the durability and the quality. Now, I already kind of mentioned the durability in the first criteria, but whenever it comes to quality, these pants, 511, they're a great brand. They have they have a lot of amazing products. And you can judge by, by the reviews uh, on Amazon, which the link you can find in the description below. Uh, it's almost 500 reviews on this pants and, and most of them are 5 stars. Uh, in fact, these pants are not even that high rated because there are some pants that have thousands of reviews. So 5.11, they're, they're doing pretty good 
in the department of quality everything feels nice everything feels good and you can see uh in most of the spots there is double stitching that is present for extra durability which is really nice really good uh now number four features uh i already mentioned the double stitching i already mentioned the durability there are eight pockets right but then on amazon uh description they do mention that there are two hidden pockets now i thought that this were the hidden pockets right here hidden back pocket right but here's the thing one two three four five six and then on this side seven and eight so i found eight pockets so i'm missing two hidden pockets not sure where they are if you can find them let me know in the comments below i really spent about half an hour before doing this review just trying to find these two hidden pockets okay <laughs> let, let me know if you find them um, another thing that i wanted to mention here in the features is that the waist is not very flexible so you kind of have to get the right sizing luckily the sizing is pretty good it's pretty on point which is actually the criteria six the sizing but since we're already talking about it let me just mention it uh they they are definitely true to the size you know some pants that i reviewed from other manufacturers they do have a problem where the waist runs a little bit smaller right or the length is a little bit smaller but no this 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 one's our own point but make sure you get the right size because like i said there isn't a lot of flexibility even in the waist uh they are gusseted uh so there is in, in a few spots there is a little bit just just tiny little bit as you can see your flexibility but really it's not a lot if you if you miss the size <laughs> you definitely miss the size now number five i think this is one of the most important ones whenever it comes to surreal situation is the balance of application right so if this really was your your last pair of pants that you put on before you run out of your house and you have to walk for miles and you know be in these different situations like fighting climbing running jumping uh <laughs> in order to survive right would this be good pants overall i think definitely the pants are pretty good you know if 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 that's what you're looking for if you don't need the cargo pants if you don't need the knee inserts which these pants do not have i wanted to mention that in features but i missed it so i'm mentioning it here no knee inserts here uh if you only you know don't need that many pockets and you, you kind of like that tough fabric which is not flexible but it's a relaxed fit if you are into that sort of stuff you will like it but if you are like me and prefer mobility over toughness and protection right uh you might find this pants a little bit restricting just because that fabric just there there isn't really any flexibility in it at all at all like really a little bit but it's just it's just barely anything you know compared to really everything else i have is not flexible at all uh but but the quality wise and uh the comfort wise they are pretty good they do feel good on your skin um so if that's if that's what you like you will definitely like this pants um number six so we already spoke the sizing definitely true to the size number seven the temperature they are very light don't expect them to you know protect you from cold temperatures uh <laughs> they're not insulated in any way at all which is not a problem here in florida but if if your survival situation is going to involve some you know cold temperatures make sure that you have some good insulated underpants to go with these guys you can definitely do that because they are a relaxed fit they're not tight so you can definitely do that and number eight is the last one is the price now the pricing like i said it's somewhere between 35 and 75 depending on which size you select and uh which color you select now this particular one was let's see So this particular color variation was actually $70. So it was closer to uh, this size and, and the color variation was closer to $70. Closer to the top, right? $69.99. Uh, 
but you can definitely get it cheaper if if you're lucky enough to to you know different different color and, and different size so let me know guys what you think in the comments below uh you know don't forget to subscribe don't forget to comment i am currently doing uh several giveaways just be picking random people random active people from my channel and giving some tactical gear to them scopes uh, different types of optics. I have some binoculars laying around some red dot systems that I will be giving out The winner will be announced on Facebook. So make sure to uh, Follow our Facebook page which you can find the the link in the description below. Thank you very much guys for watching This was firearms of America. I'll see you guys in the next video